everywhere like babies make sound like wah 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 bells make sound like jungling guitar makes sound like doo 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 and apple makes sound like can you hear that this is 35 but I am a champion and you're gonna hear at me roar wah yeah and then police car makes sound like Now, let's hear it very technically. Sound is produced by vibrations, like this is the vibration. Can you see the vibrations? But what are vibrations? They move so fast that they are invisible. It's like this. If you can see these moving, they are, they are moving so fast that they are getting invisible when I put them on the other side. Alright guys, travels in waves. It travels through air, water and solid objects. So, how does sound travel through air? It starts with a mechanical movement which causes some vibrations. So, this is a mechanical movement. So, this sound disturbs the first air layer. Then the first air layer pushes the second layer and goes back to its position. Then second layer pushes the third layer and goes back to its position. So this happens every time so fast and fast until it reaches our ears. And then we get to hear. But how the sound travels through water? Well, the sound travels much better in the water because the molecules in the water are more closer together. So how does sound travel to solid objects? So bang anything that's solid made up of wood or something. Then put your ear to it. Bang it again. Which one was louder? When you put your ear to anything that's solid in your house, sound can bend around corners and obstacles. For example, if your mom is in the balcony and you are in your room and you shout and say something, your mom will not be able to hear it very good. Because if you have a door, a window or the wall through the balcony, then the sound will bend around that and come back to you like a boomerang. When pirates move fast, a high one must sound as well. And if Python moves slowly, a low volume of sound is produced. So, what do you see first? Lightning or thunder? Well, it is lightning because the speed from light travels much faster than sound. As a result, we see lightning followed by the sound of thunder. Time for some fun. Love it. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> okay, so did you know the sun surface even produces a sound like um, um, um? Krakatoa is believed to be the loudest sound produced on the surface of planet. It even shattered the sailors that were 40 miles away. That's a lot. It might be the loudest volcano, but might not be hearing me. Guys, maybe you're wondering why did he keep a dog in my house? For a watchman, but how? Animals like dogs have the highest frequency of hearing sound. So this capability means that animals like dogs can sense oncoming danger. Of course, the thief will not ring the bell and come in. So, no sound can travel in a vacuum because there is no molecules to carry the vibrations. Have you ever heard a spaceship exploding in space? You cannot hear anything because there is no air in space so 
You cannot hear anything in it. If you see some video games, those sounds are video games. Okay.